Hi guys, Battle Group Gamer here, coming at you with another broadside of naval action, and today we are playing Cold Waters. We are still continuing our South China Sea 2000 Second Patrol campaign. That's a lot. That's quite a mouthful there. Um, and right now we have the task of we're trying to catch a resupply group. Um, well, resupplying some warships over in the East China Sea. And I've got to get past this little encounter first. Scattered light air, so it's quiet. Strong duct, moderate thermal layer, 172 feet. On sonar, new rig ship for ultra quiet. Make depth two zero zero feet, dive by. Let's get these guys on our new contact bearing. Identified. Seven designated Sierra three. Yeah, that's a Luda. Lou, just a regular Luda. On sonar, Sierra one is classified as escort. Jinghu three. Con sonar. Sierra two is classified as escort. That might be a merchant. Or maybe not. I don't know. Oh, that's right. I just got under the layer. Make depth one five zero feet. Die by. Let's make that a little better. But I will stick with the warships first. That can't be right. Nope. Merge into Con us. Sonar. Sierra 3 is classic. Con. Dive at one five zero feet. Dive by. So I really only have two to worry about. Now which way are they heading? Going to make depth four by I'm going to five. get a little risky with this one. Little risky Ricky there. I might be far enough away to get a good ESM um contact on both of these, which would upgrade from Sierra to Master. But I'm also a little nervous because if there's a helicopter nearby, um, it might cause some issues. Right two, two, five, five, helm I. Lower uh, the ESM mast. Getting down. Make depth five, zero, zero feet, die by. Uh, yeah, there there is a helicopter or aircraft really close and I just got lit up somewhere somehow some way and as soon as I get back under this layer which I am I'm gonna go ahead and start launching 
Aye, sir. And I'll wait until I get down to my 500 feet before moving these torpedoes. Because I could break a wire. That's always a possibility. planes are starting to balance out a little bit. Con, helm, steady course. And we are now traveling in the direction that we are going to to get our second leg on these uh, solution maneuverings. If you do kind of a kind of a little zigzag, you will get kind of different-ish positions for your constant contact and it gives you sort of a triangulation. going to get these torpedoes off of a direct bearing back to me. We are getting better uh, solution percentages, which is always a nice thing. We'll just let these dive at five zero zero feet dive by. And we'll just let these um kind of do their thing for a minute. Yeah, that works. Maybe I will just go ahead and ping them as they are picking up on their quarry. You know, I do kind of enjoy this a little bit more. But this is a lot prettier. Let me see what this does. Well, I certainly hope that upping the settings didn't cause any kind of lag spikes. Because that would be unfortunate. That's a sonar boy. Huh, in the wrong spot. Yeah, nobody still can pick me up. And now I'm pretty sure they have no clue where the hell I am. Well, the Luda almost has a very confident uh, torpedo solution. And obviously, it's a lot farther out than we anticipated, I hope. Although, I guess 
I need to, well, for starters, get a new leg going. Come left to two zero eight Elm I. Con fire control weapon acquired. Well, there's the Zheng Hu, and there's the Luda. And I'm not sure at all where that Con, fire control, weapon acquired. particular sonar buoy got dropped. Because that's a noisemaker. Does the Luda not know? It has to. Con sonar lost contact. Right. Sierra one last bearing two zero seven contact faded. And now the contact's con breaking up. Regained contact on Sierra one bearing two zero seven. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two last bearing two five one contact breaking up. Well, that was easy. And oh god. Con helm steady course. I really should. Could have looked at that. I don't know. Well, I am able to get away, but I'm going to load my tubes first. Come left to zero two nine Helm I. Con torpedo room tube one ready. Ah, uh, hurry up. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Oh, thanks, Moon. I forgot to silence you. Alright, let's get this going. Yes, I know that's not my mission objective, and now I am really... Ooh. Oh, come on. On so rig shift for ultra quiet. Back emergency, maneuver guy. Make turns for five knots, maneuvering eye. Eighty one decibels. Can nope, there are vessels nearby. Crap. All right, what are you? Strong glare. Con maneuvering, making turns for five knots. Depth two zero zero feet dive by. Is that a warship? Almost a noodaloy. No, this might be a merchant. Also, are there submarines in this particular scenario? Is this a submarine? In before it's an alpha. Hmm. It's an alpha. Con sonar, Sierra One is classified as a submerged submarine. Six point three kiloyards. Well, if he pings, he picks me up. All right, so I want to get on the other side of this. Make depth one zero zero feet, die by. Which way are you heading, Alpha? Right towards me. Nice. I really hope I can do the uh, intercept mission with missiles, because apparently I'm going to have only two torpedoes left. Although I suppose if I'm able to take out two of the escorts, everything else should 
go a little easier. But, uh, well, I'm also at 100%, so that's a plus. Three anti-ship missiles in my vertical launch tubes. Total of seven harpoons. And, uh, we, we are at one zero zero feet dive. No, oh, that passive number. Come left to two zero four helm I. Maybe if I can just maneuver out of the way. Is this the only submarine? Come on, dive at one zero zero feet dive on. There you go. I'm pretty sure that, you know, in real life, subs typically are solo creatures, but in cold waters, it doesn't really seem to be the case. They, they usually travel in packs. Alright, let's... Let's get away from this guy. Con, helm, steady course. I would like to not use a torpedo. Come left to one, three, nine, helm, I. Good, good, go away. Go away, all the way out to 15,000 yards. Con, helm, steady course. And I'm ahead in the opposite direction, just to ensure. Must be some high frequent notes. Huh, slow frequency. Oh, for the passive. Huh. 40 knots, 1500 yards. Oh, right. Whoo! But I can leave. Nice. Yes, I know. Do we have our quarry? Shantou, momentarily, for a rendezvous somewhere in the East China Sea. Are they coming up this way? And I'm spotted. That's them. Ten knots, 150. Strong surface duct, strong thermal layer. At 90 feet. Con, rig ship for ultra quiet. 83 decibels. And if you tilt up just slightly, you can still see the thermal layer being shown. So I think if I were to pop up Con, above the contact, layer, bearing, any kind three, of submarine four, contact six, designated Sierra, one. would be a little slower to... Damn, you're quiet. I need to get a little closer. Hell, do I just go up to 50? Make depth 5, 0 feet, die by. Come 
Helm left to two zero zero. Helm I. Once again, I would like to avoid using torpedoes. Con sonar new contact bearing zero zero four designated Sierra two. All right, let's just go through this. This doesn't really appear to be any kind of warship. That can't be right. Con sonar Sierra Two is classified as merchant. And I'm gonna Con put it there for the time being. Five, zero feet dive by. All right, fine. Still can't quite make any of this out. Another alpha? Con sonar Sierra 1 is classified as submerged submarine. So if we can just get the alpha to go away. That would be swell. Nope. Yeah, I'm starting to think it's an alpha. Yeah, that that's what I'm gonna say it is. Seems to be under the layer while I stay above. And holy shit, that just jumped a lot closer. Ten for active, negative twenty for passive. So he obviously can't hear me yet. Con, Helm, steady course. Hmm, seems I can barely pick him up on passive. Totoray has a better chance, though. What happens if I drop down below the layer? Make depth one, zero, zero feet, die by. What's the floor at, 333? Kind of these numbers jump. Not yet below the layer, because the layer's at 90. We are now at 80 feet. 12, negative 19. 12, negative 18. Con sonar lost contact. 22, negative zero, 9. Two. Last bearing, 0, 0, 0. Con. Con. Dive at one zero zero feet. Dive by. So yes. Even though it's not shown in this, that layer still exists. Just for, you know, the boys and girls at home. This this is very uncomfortably close. Left to one five two helm I. I don't want to fight you. But now, now, uh, yeah, now that I'm below the layer, I can get a much better, faster solution on this alpha. I really hope he's not 3,000 yards away from me. That makes it very, very difficult to uh, get the hell away.
when this negative nine gets to zero, I'm... Well, shit, he'll probably be like a thousand yards away. This is making me so bloody nervous. Three torpedoes left. Shit ton of missiles. It's a shame I don't have any more uh, surface contacts to go after. Come on, buddy. Helm. Steady course. Come left to zero six one. Helm I. Yeah, I don't think I can avoid that for much longer. So I'm going to go ahead and put myself in a position to uh, just launch one into his side. Especially at 2,700 yards? That... Ugh, how close are you in reality? I mean, we only have a 73% solution. Numbers are not changing all that much. Ah, and we're coming up on almost a half hour here. It's a it does look like we'll have to save the uh, resupply force sinking for another episode. Alright, so the Alpha is in actuality 2,500 er, 2500 yards away. But won't show up until this number hits 95%. There he is. Also, this is just a little too far um, to launch because snapshotted torpedoes, uh, from what I've observed, this could be totally wrong, by the way, from what I've observed, uh, will activate at 3,000 yards. Con, helm, steady course. Of course, if he slows down below 10 knots to do any kind of listening, I will be immediately detected. Come left to three, five, four, helm I. Negative two. Just turned kind of in a big circle here, didn't I? I probably could have had a faster getaway, but I did not want to lose sound on the Alpha. Two thousand yards away. <laughs> Negative two for the passive. I will absolutely wait until the last second. Come left to three, two, nine, helm I. Because the closer I get. Zero feet, die by. The closer I get, the better my chances of survival are. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra two bearing three four nine. So we still have a good. Oh, that Alpha, did he slow down? No. 
but we are still at uh, very concerning passive numbers. Con, dive at five zero feet, dive by. Con, helm, steady course. All right, when that one jumps to a two, I'm a launch. Unless... Holy crap, can I actually get away from this guy? Two. All right. Zero, three, four. Helm, I. I don't know how I've managed, but I managed. Of course, if he pings, I'm still screwed. Con, helm, steady course. Oh, wow. He was just sailing straight south, not caring. Good deal. Although we are in his baffles. I can afford to speed up. Make depth one five zero feet. Dive by. Con dive at one five zero feet. Dive by. But if I speed up to ten knots, I don't think I'll be able to hear him so well. So I'm just gonna do this. He's sailing straight, not even turning. He hasn't even so much as picked up a scent. Oh, now he's turning. Come left to three, two, two, helm, I. Maybe he was just doing a, uh, a baffles check. Con, helm, Steady course. Yeah, it seems like what he was doing. We just need you to travel 4,000 yards further. I'm glad I was able to uh, just slip on by the, the deaf guy. Any day now. We are at time compression, so hurry up. I think that's the closest I've ever been to somebody that I did not want to shoot at. Oh yeah, we can we can totally leave combat now. It was just the alpha in the water. And we did see, coming through the Taiwan Strait, um, our quarry approaching. So I'm going to have to continue. That's the guy right there. So I do need to have myself approaching a little bit more this way, I guess. But yeah, that's them coming from Shantou into the East China Sea where I'm waiting. Hopefully we do have some aircraft keeping the guy spotted. I'd like to go into the engagement as slow as humanly possible, and that means not touching the mouse at all. Because, all right, if you're holding the left mouse button to move around on the map, starting an engagement puts you at 20 knots. With the right mouse button, you start the engage... Oh, 20 knots at 600 feet, unless unless it's shallower than that. Uh, right click is 10 knots at 150 feet. Once again, terrain permitting. I don't think there's anything closer than... I don't know, like 200 feet. Anyways, and just letting go of the mouse, you will start the engagement 50 feet, 5 knots... And at the absolute quietest that you can start an engagement. But we'll have to uh, see how the resupply group uh, handles my presence in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching this one, by the way. 
feel free to leave a comment. Feedback is always appreciated. Like the video if you enjoyed what you saw, and subscribe if you'd like to see some more. Once again, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode.